Hey guys, it's Jill, and welcome to an In the Dressing Room. Actually, welcome back to my channel. Don't forget to subscribe, click the notification bell, follow me on Instagram and Snapchat. And we are here at Maurice's. You guys asked, I'm not sure if you asked for like a try-on haul or an In the Dressing Room, but we're just going to do an In the Dressing Room. So, yeah, we are here. We're going to, I've never, literally never even heard of Maurice's, I don't think. I know for sure I've never been in an actual Maurice's store. So I have no idea what they have in there. Looking from the outside in, it kind of looks like a Kato to me, but we will see. Totally forgot to tell you that there is this thing called the Sephora Squad that I am applying to be a part of. It's basically a sponsorship with Sephora. And they are looking for you guys to spread and share your testimony, not spread, share your testimony with them. It's not like 100% based on just that, but the testimonies from you guys do help. So if you are ever so compelled to do so, please, please, please go. I will have a link in the comments down below where you just basically leave your testimony as to how I in, like why you guys keep coming back to my channel, how I influence you or why I, why, why, I, how I inspire you guys and like what it is about me that keeps you coming back to my channel. Um, so yeah, if you are so compelled to do so, I would really, really, really love for you guys to support and help me out in that, like a Sephora sponsorship, y'all. That would be amazing. That's like literally dream come true status right there. So yeah, link will be down below for that. And let's go ahead and get into this Maurice's and let's get into this dressing room. Okay, so this is what I'm wearing today. I got this shirt, I believe, from Zaff Zaffle. I think is where it's called. Um, I got this like a couple years ago, but it's just like ombre. I actually wore this the last time I did it in the dressing room. But um, yeah, just these jeans from. Golly, where did I get these jeans from? I don't know, but they're YMI jeans, and then I'm just wearing these Van lookalikes that are from Target. And I have got all this stuff. I've got lots of jeans. The only thing is, I didn't get a dress, so I think I'm gonna have to like go into the straight size section and see if I can find a dress. But we've got some shirts, a jacket, pad shirt, and lots of jeans to try. I think I've got like five pair. One, two, three, four, five. So I'm gonna go ahead and try these on. I got all size 22s in the jeans. These are the Everflex. And let's see, they are also high rise. So the Everflex high rise, size 22, $59. And I'm going to try it on with these two things right here. This shirt is so incredibly soft. It's an extra, extra large. So this is from the straight size section, $24. And then this plaid, yeah, it's not really flannel, it's plaid, um, size two. $34. So that's what we're trying on first. Okay, so here's this one. The size 22 jeans are actually perfect. These are the high rise ones. So you see how high they come up. They cover my belly button. And I always get a belly deck, right? 
<laughs> decent not like anything like my towel but yeah so this shirt came from the straight size section and it's super 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 soft but I don't like how it clings right here so I'm definitely not a fan of it in the way that it fits but I do like this plaid shirt it's super cute and you can roll up the sleeves or you can wear them down um, size 2 is a good fit it looks like it will definitely button if I wanted to but I wouldn't want to button the shirt I think it would look good with like how it is you know like a shirt underneath it or a tank or something um, let me show you this shirt on its own it's got a little pocket and what are those those are boats <laughs> stuck in the tags okay literally the tags are stuck together so I'm not gonna be able to take it off until like okay anyways until I take this shirt off but yeah that's the way that the shirt looks like I said it's like little boats and it's got a little pocket on the side and like I said it is super 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 soft it's got the little um baseball hemline I guess you call it on the sides super cute that's how far it goes in the back I just don't like how it kind of clings to this area but other than that it's cute Okay, so this too came from the straight size section. It is an extra, extra large. Would it be a Jill try-on without anything black and white? No, it would not. So, of course, this caught my eye. I love this little letter detail right here. As you can see, it is a little low cut and it's showing my bra, so that's, like, not anything that, like, I'm crazy about. Um, I do like how the sleeves are nicely, like, you know, like, they don't show my bra or anything. But I don't like shirts this long. This shirt... It's super soft just like the other one but I'm not crazy I think like for one the jeans are kind of like they're not tight they are like pushing at my stomach just like a little bit and this kind of clingy fabric just kind of accentuates that so that's what it looks like in the back it's a really cute shirt and I really like it like I said it's totally me but just don't like it kind of accentuates this area did I tell you this was $20 from the straight set section so extra extra large okay I'm gonna try these ones on next I'm super excited about these ones because they're so cute but these are the jeggings high rise denim flex these are also size 22 and they're $44 can you see how cute they are like have the distressing and on the, on the bottom and then I'm gonna try on this shirt, this was from the straight size section, extra extra large, $24. Happy go lucky. How cute is that? So I'm gonna try that on now. And then I'll probably actually throw this jacket over. So let's go ahead and talk about this. $59, size three, from the plus size section. How cute is all of this distressing? That is like a really cute denim jacket. Okay, so here are these jeans. I absolutely, absolutely, absolutely love them. They are perfection. Um, let's see, where's the zoom? Do you guys see that detail on the ankle? And then they have distressing right at the knee, which I normally don't like because normally when you have distressing at the knee, it's like normally just like one cut and then that's it. But as you can see, this one is like a little more. It's like really cute. These are like super, um, what's the word? Like they feel like leggings. They are like very light they feel like you're really not wearing jeans i love them i love this little detail right here they don't have pockets by the way um i don't think the other ones do either these ones that i tried on actually did have do have pockets so and these ones do not of course they have them in the back that's what it looks like is it distressed in the back no no distressing at all just a little um bit of it's not flare. What is that called? I can't think of it, but um, yeah, you can see it. And then this shirt right here is super cute. Love the color, love the little slits on the side. I actually like the way that this one fits. And then I like the little white on the sleeves right there. And it just says happy go lucky. And it's v-neck and it's super cute. So really cute for St. Patrick's Day coming up. 
Okay, so this one is a size 3 because it's like the biggest one that they have. I really like this a lot. I personally just think like for spring, I really just don't know about denim jackets like in Georgia. I'm actually in South Carolina right now, but either one, in Georgia or South Carolina, both. I'm just like no when it comes to jackets in the spring. But I know you guys like to see because you guys, you know, don't necessarily have spring until like close to June, May. Sorry, guys. But yeah, the distressing on this is super cute. And so is this. I'm trying to think of the name of this. It's not flare. It's, I used to do this all the time with my jeans. I don't know. It's like really cute distressing. Maybe when I'm editing, I will remember what this is called. Frayed. Frayed. <laughs> it's frayed. And you have the distressing right here and it buttons nicely. The only thing that I think about this, I may like want to have sized down because when it kind of goes out like this, it just gets a little boxy and I'm not a fan of that. So I would have to keep like pulling on it to make sure that it laid like this so it kind of like accentuated my curves and didn't, you know, look so boxy. But other than that, it's really, really, really cute. The buttons are bronze, so you could do it like that. That's actually my favorite when it comes to a denim jacket, like to look like that. But you see, there's the sleeve right there. And there's the back. Now I normally don't like denim on denim, but I actually like these two together. Like I would totally wear this as an outfit with the sleeve pulled up, of course. But yeah, that's super cute. It's cropped. I really, really, really like this jacket. It's got pockets. It's a little, pockets are kind of small. I'm about to say I can barely fit my hand in there, but oh no, I think, nope, there's stitching. So never mind. You could totally fit your hand in there once you get it home. Okay, so these are the next ones I'm trying on. I love cuffed jeans and I loved ones that already come cuffed. So I think I'm going to like these. These are also 22s. $49 and these are the mid-rise denim flex jegging. So what does that say? Slimmest leg opening sits below the waist. And then I'm going to try it on with this. This is a size 2. $24 and it says skinny. Skinny? <laughs> no. Sunny skies ahead. And yes, Georgia, like listen, we need some sun. We need some sun, y'all. It's been raining like crazy. And I know you guys are getting a lot of snow. So we're gonna go ahead and try these two on. Okay, so these, as you can see, are distressed. They do not have pockets. Um, they have the distressing on the knees as well, which is super cute, and then they have the cuffing down there. I actually am not, like, I think it, I think for me to like this, it would have had to be, it's the length for me. I'm 5'4", so I'm definitely on the shorter side, so I think these would be cuter if they were, like, more, like more like capris or maybe like right there you see that you see the difference in that that looks much better than this so it's more of a length issue than anything because these are really they just feel amazing now these are the mid-rise but they actually come up like the high-rise do on me um and i think that's again because of my length but these are like really cute check okay and then here is the shirt right here I actually like the way this fits sunny skies ahead like the font is like really cute and it's like you can actually like feel it you know can you see that it's like raised font <laughs> y'all I'm like trying not to fall over um v-neck super cute like the arms are like baggy this is like a good fit this is like a really good fit you know kind of like a little bit loose but not too loose to where you look like frumpy this is a good fit so I like this let's try on next we're gonna try on this like I said it can't be a jill haul without like black and white and then let's see I have these jeans that I want to try on so these ones are 22s $39 and these are the mid-rise jegging denim flex and this one right here is a size 2 and it's $39 so here are these jeans mm, mm, 
they're actually I actually could size down on these ones so all of the darker ones which I tell you guys like darker ones usually you want to kind of like size up lighter ones you can definitely size down so I definitely could go into a 20 on these ones these are the jeans like I said these are mid-rise but again they kind of go a little high-rise on me that's the back of them and this shirt is really cute it's more like a blousey material and when you get around like right here by my hips it gets a little tight it's like not it's not stretchy material at all but it's super cute with the little ruffles and the little cold shoulder detail and then there's the sleeve right there so it's cute but if they were stretchy I feel like it would be better a better fit for me I definitely would probably want to size up on this one Okay, so these ones are $49.88.98, but he told me that they are on sale today for like $9.99. So I'm like, I like these. They're probably coming home with me, but these are a size 22 and they are the crop. And as you can see, they're white and then they have like this cute little detail on the side. And I thought for like a cute little nautical theme, I would try it on with this navy and white striped shirt that I know is a size 2. At least I think it is. Let's see how much it is. $29 size 2. <laughs> you guys see these crops on me? <laughs> they're supposed to be cropped and they're just ankle length on me. Hey, that's, that's what it's like to be short. But here is the shirt. It has this little tie on the bottom right here. It has like this little boat neck. I was like, is this supposed to go off the shoulder? And then I tried and I was like, no, it's just a boat neck. So, um, it's not my favorite on me. Like, can you guys see, like it has this little detail going down right here and then it goes into the tie. Like something is throwing it off. I don't know what it is, but yeah, I don't like the way it looks on me. Long sleeves, it's nice and soft. It's really great quality. And there's the back. I don't know you can probably see through these I don't know I can't really tell but um they seem like they're more of a cream than they are white they do have pockets like functioning pockets which is always nice but yeah that's what a crop looks like on me <laughs> these by far are definitely my favorite and like I said I didn't say this but I will try to find everything and link it down below for you guys so if you want to shop um but these are the high rise jaking and they're the denim flex so i really like these a lot they're definitely my favorite and they were the ones that were distressed at the knees all right so i'm gonna try these two together size three 29 dollars and this little jacket is super cute size two 39 this size three was like the smallest one no, they had a one and a three, they didn't have a two. And then I'm just gonna go ahead and show you the rest. So this is so cute. Size one, 39, I felt like I'd get a size one because it's kind of oversized. And then this one right here with the back cut out is also a size one and it's $44. So that's everything we have left to try on. Okay, so this jacket is really cute. It's really soft, it does not have pockets. It's kind of like a, almost like a felt material but I know that's not what it is I'll tell you what material it is when I take it off do you see the cute little detail here and then like the cute little buttons and then the like it's colorless I would definitely go with a size one on this um it's it has like lots of give and like lots of would I say stretch like do you see how much is like left in the arms that's what it looks like in the back and that's what the shirt's gonna look like in the back. So it kind of goes over the butt. And I think if I were gonna do this jacket, I would personally do it with a tank top that's tucked in. So I wouldn't do it with something flowy. Um, but yeah, I mean, this is kind of cute. This kind of reminds me of like scrubs though. Something that a nurse would wear. Ooh something a nurse would wear it does have this cute little zipper detail which you can unzip and kind of make it a little lower cut if you wanted to i feel like 
definitely this is definitely too big on me see like I don't like the sleeves or just it's it just I don't like the fit on this the pattern's okay like I'm really picky when it comes to floral and this is definitely a floral that I'm like not super like crazy about but I saw that they had paired this and that together and that's why I wanted to try it okay this is really cute like I really really like this is this the one I size down on I can't remember. I'll have to go back and then I'll put it on the screen. I can't remember if this is size two or not, but I love this sweat sweatshirt, whatever, like long sleeve shirt so much. It's got like the little high low where it's lower in the back, shorter in the front, but it's still like a tunic tunic length. It has the little slits on the side. It has a V-neck. It's just a plain gray sweatshirt. And then when you turn around, Cute. Let me get in on that a little closer. That is so cute. I love that. Do you know what I would love to see this in? A workout shirt. Like um, maybe a tank top or a shirt that goes down to here like with like short sleeves. That is so pretty. I love that. And then that's what it looks like when you kind of step further away. But that is, I really like this shirt. It's kind of plain. But it's like business in the front, party in the back. I really like this and I like the way it fits too. Okay, so yes, I have a wrong, <laughs> just so you know, I'm not sitting here naked. Um, size one, so definitely size down in this one, I think. I mean, unless you want an over, like a more oversized look. Okay, and then here's this one. This one also definitely, I would say size down because I still feel like it gives you that oversized look. It's definitely oversized, has a nice V-neck. This one I'm not as crazy about. I feel like it's the same length, but I think it maybe it's the lighter color that I don't like. Or maybe it is a little longer. I think the other one came up here. That's what it looks like in the back. Oh yeah, I forgot. It's got this little detail, so let's get a little closer. Now that's cute. I really like that. And I would love to see more shirts in this kind of style. That's just so cute to like show just like a little bit of your back. It's like super sexy and super cute. I love it. But other than that, like I'm not super crazy. It definitely is a lighter sweater. So this would be perfect for a spring sweater if you're like up north or if you have weather that's not like super hot like it is in Georgia. But um, yeah, this is my last one. I will see you guys back in the car. Okay, so Maurice's. First of all, a huge thank you to Nikki for helping me out. You are so tremendously helpful. So thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, okay, now, as far as the style, I feel like it's kind of like a Kato. Um, there are some things in there that I would definitely go in and be like, oh my gosh, this is so me, and I would like totally shop it and buy it. But the one pair of jeans I totally loved, overall personal style, definitely not me for the whole store. Like, I couldn't go into that store and, like, find several, several, several outfits and be like, oh my gosh, like, you know, that's my store that I go to shop at. I could go in there and get, like, a few pieces here and there and be like, oh yeah, that's, like, a great place to go to get, like, some cute things. My style is definitely more trendy, but I also like comfy things and stuff like that. I just, I don't like the length of most of their, most of their things. It was just like a little more conservative. Y'all, I have not seen my Escalade today. Where is my Escalade? I've got to see an Escalade at least one time when I'm out a day, and I have not seen it yet. Prices are a little, a little up there. Um, I feel definitely not Forever 21, but the quality was pretty good. Now, I've never owned anything from Maurice's. I don't know, like, how they stand up, like, how well they hold up as far as, like, overall, you know what I'm saying, through washes and stuff, but as far as, like, just trying them on and feeling the quality, it was, it was good, so, you know, it was, like, really good, so, yeah, that will do it for this video, I hope that you guys enjoyed, I hope people don't mind being in my video, there's, like, I guess, it, oh, there's, like, a Diablos right over here, um, and a sushi buffet so it's lunchtime so people are like all around but yeah let me know in the comments down below where you guys want me to go do a try on haul next and in, in in the dressing room next as far as try ons are concerned i have one from yoins i know that's like a really weird name um 
where else do I have one from? Rose Gal mixed in with Tord, which I need to do that one. And that one should be up next week. But yeah, happy Friday. Hope you guys have an awesome, incredible, amazing weekend. I love you so much. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.